From books to school supplies, backpacks, a lot of things that the students need to be successful throughout the school year. But for the students at the Columbus City Preparatory School for Boys, it's part of the everyday uniform that school leaders say is tied to their success. NBC 4's Matthew Herchick has the story. Well, tying a tie for many is simply part of a normal morning routine, but for one group of students, it's a symbol of their role as the next group of scholars to come through school doors. It's a yearly tradition for the students at the Columbus City Preparatory School for Boys. A lot of our young boys, you know, uh, don't know how to tie a tie. But the school's annual tie tying ceremony is more than a practical gesture for the nearly 150 students in grades 6 through 8. It's um, representative of the beginning of our years. The first thing that we do is learn to tie our tie so we can orient ourselves throughout day and, and, and achieve our goals. For the 6th graders, the moment represents a new beginning, while for the 8th grade students, it's the closing of a new chapter. It's kind of like a life aspect, like how you should follow life, how you should act around other people and all that. Columbus City Schools graduate and former Buckeye basketball player George Reese served as the keynote speaker. He joined city leaders, community members, and parents in lending a helping hand to the new class of young men. Anything that they can do outside of the classroom to keep them motivated to come into school, staying in the school, and they're doing the work, coming here to do work, uh, to graduate is always empowering. The young men recite their creed, committing to values of accountability, respect, integrity, service, and excellence. But as the new year begins, they won't be alone. School leaders urging that it takes a village to raise a child. I don't really even have the words to say how important it is to show our young men that, you know, there's intergenerational conversations and connections that they need uh, to learn from, from uh, the current leaders because they are on their way to become our future leaders. Now, the tie tying ceremony is an annual event, and as the school continues to try to grow their program, they say that they hope to have even more young men participating next year. Local for you in Columbus, Matthew Herchick, NBC4.